So you want some more ideas for videos, huh? I got gotcha. you. Hey y'all, I'm Robert Kennedy, the third RK3, and I love storytelling. And I love pizza, like good New York pizza. And burritos, I like burritos too. Mm -mm. But that's not why you're here. You're like, dude, I'm trying to get into this whole video storytelling thingamabob, but I have no darn idea what to make videos about. Well, first of all, I've got this really neat video here that gives you five ideas that you can use right now. And today I've got five more that I'm gonna gift you. But first, two words, subscribe and a bell. Now, what can you make videos about? Here's number one. You can make videos about positive things happening in your city or positive things about your city. For example, did you know that our city is in the top 10 in the nation for blah, 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 blah? Or maybe you could talk about how your city has the most parks per capita or the most dogs or cats per capita. Finding something positive about your city, your neighborhood, or your area is a great way to share your expertise and knowledge of that area or city. Number two thing that you can make videos about, you can talk about the market trends happening in your area as well. For example, what is the inventory like in that area? Are houses selling? Are they going off the market? Is now a good time to buy or sell? What's happening? Maybe house sales are trending in specific areas and your area is right in that path for that trend. What can you do to prepare for that boom in house sales? Video idea number three, testimonials. Have you ever looked for a product online? One of the first things that you do is you look for the reviews. You go to Yelp or you go to Google reviews to find out how many people have said something about that particular product, that restaurant, that place, and what are the reviews like? Why not do the same thing for yourself as an agent? Get people, get your customers, get your clients to give testimonials, record them, and make videos about them. What about doing a video testimonial right at the closing table or right after the closing? What about doing a video testimonial the moment that you hand them the keys to the property? You have some great ideas already, and now I just want to remind you, take a moment to subscribe and hit that bell so that you can get notified every time I drop new videos. I just wanted to make sure that you got what I was saying when I said those two words, subscribe and bell earlier. I need to give some instructions, clear instructions. Video idea number four. What are some of the successful sales trends or things that are in common in your area? For example, if a lot of houses have sold in the area over the last three months, what do those houses all have in common? Yeah, I know they've got walls and possibly grass, maybe. But things in common might be something that your audience is interested in. For example, were all of the top selling homes over the last few months painted blue? Do they have brick faces? Did all of the top selling homes over the last three months have a covered patio? or deck. Sharing things in common gives people some idea of what the market is looking at, especially in that area. Maybe it might be time for an improvement before you sell, or maybe you'll just have some idea of how to creatively market the property. And number five, that's not five, that's 10, just five. Number five, giving live interviews to loan officers, agents, restaurants, small business owners, inspectors, plumbers, hardware store owners. Do they still have those or did Home Depot and Lowe's take over the entire place? Anyone who might have something to do with the entire home sales or purchase process. Those might be great people to interview and can give your customer, your client, some insight into the process. And it can position you as an expert, knowledgeable, and connected with all of the right people. I hope you got some fantastic ideas from this video. Do me a favor, join us in the strategic video storytelling group linked in the description below and tell me what are some of the other ideas that you have for making video stories? I'd love to hear them. Feel free to ask any questions in the comments and I'll be sure to make a video response to your question. I'll see you soon in an upcoming video.